Hello, welcome to another video from us here at Quattro Tech Cars. In this video, I'm showing you around the 2018 Skoda Kurok that we now have in stock. Uh, it's got a nice little rhyme to it, isn't it? So this is a 1.5, 150 PS uh, turbo petrol. It's got the DSG gearbox. You can see it's finished in the metallic quartz gray with black Alcantara interior. It's the SEL spec. Uh, so we have quite a lot of specification to go through. Uh, optional extras on this car, actually quite rare spec, is the electric tailgate. Uh, we also have the likes of heated front seats, along with a heated steering wheel, um, folding mirrors, a heated front windscreen is the other option uh, as well. We've got satellite navigation. Of course, we have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And there is lots more to go through. Uh, so during the course of this video, I'll be going into a bit more detail. So then to start with, we'll have a look in the boot and then we'll work our way forwards as the video goes on. Uh, one thing to note in the car, it's always a good sign when you can see this, but we have a boot liner. So that is fitted specifically for the Karok. It is of course removable, it's not attached anywhere, but it just means the carpet underneath looks pretty much brand new. Um, and then underneath that boot floor, you can see we have the full size spare wheel and we have all the tools under there as well. We have the split folding and uh, completely movable rear seats as well. So you've got top tether attachments as well as isofix mounts for the rear facing child seats. And you've got these hangers and rails on either side, which you can use for your shopping bags or clothes or whatever you might need. We also have a cargo net that's still in there with the car as well to kind of hunker things down. And of course, the super rare electric tailgate. Moving on to the interior, I mentioned earlier it has the black Alcantara. So we actually have a combination of black leather with contrasting stitching and the black Alcantara in the central pieces of the seats. You can see the Isofix mounts just along the bottom of the seats there. So all the caps are still intact, which is again, a very good sign. We've got a lighter gray headlining, which brightens it up, makes it feel a lot more spacious than it already is on the inside. And then you have the seat backs, which can fold out as tables for the rear passengers. And then finally, while I'm sat in the driver's seat, we can have a look around at what we have in the front. So to start with, we have the leather finished multifunctional steering wheel. So that is a heated steering wheel as well. So as long as you've got the heated seats on in the front, you'll notice that the steering wheel starts to heat up as well. We've got the cruise control, uh, which is of course the adaptive cruise control just underneath there. We've got the paddles for the DSG box. We've got a nice, very easy to use uh, onboard trip computer. So currently on the navigation, um, but you can see your driving data, which shows your range, says how long you've been driving and lots of different data on there. We have the automatic LED headlights. So that also brings the automatic uh, windscreen wipers, sorry. We still have front and rear fog lights that can come in handy. We've got electrically adjustable wing mirrors, uh, which are folding as well. They also have blind spot monitors as well. So if you can see there, if anyone's in blind spot, it will just let you know that somebody is there. We of course have electric windows all around as well. Moving to infotainment, I think I mentioned earlier very briefly that we have satellite navigation. You can still plug your phone into the USB as well. So that will give you Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, depending on if you have a smartphone, whether it's Android or Apple. Um, and then you can have things like Google Maps, or Waze, or you know anything you might prefer to use. There's a TomTom Tom app you can use now as well, which is something I'm still to try. Uh, we have DAB radio. We still tune into FM and AM if you wanted to as well. We can connect our phone to Bluetooth and we can answer phone calls, make phone calls and play media through that way as well. If I just put it into reverse quickly, you'll see we have a reversing camera, front and rear sensors as well. Electronic park brake with auto hold or hill assist. This button brings up the driver mode. So you've got the presets of eco, normal and sport. And then in individual, you can make the car feel a little bit more your own by making the steering heavy or light. Uh, and it changes the power delivery as well. It's worth mentioning as well, we have the park assist pack. So this button here 
if you wanted to parallel park, it will assist you in that as well. All you need to do is the pedal work. It will do all the steering for you. So I'll just pan around so you can see the condition for one last time, and then I'll pan back to the outside. So there we have a quick look at our croc. At this point in the video, it's worth noting that all of our cars here go through a structured mechanical check with our own Volkswagen Audi Specialist Workshop here at Quattrotech. All the service history will be listed in the advert for you to look into, and we will always make sure that all servicing requirements are up to date before any sort of handover. An MOT will also be complete while the car is in stock with us, and when you purchase the vehicle, it will come with a comprehensive warranty as well as breakdown cover. There are ways to extend that uh, from six months all the way up to 36 months, and it is VAT registered, so it's national basically. Any VAT registered garage, you can use that warranty uh, if you ever did need to. So if you're interested in our Karok, or if you have any questions for us, or if you'd like to book an appointment to come and view the car or test drive, please feel free to give us a call and we'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching.